Hi everyone, just going to share another success story with you this week and this time I had the chance to work with Andy Cousins and we had a, a look at his irons and then at the end of the lesson we had a look at his driving and it's just a little bit of instruction, not very much change in technique, we'll see that we managed to get Andy another 24 yards of carry off the tee and we just have a quick look up through some of these shots, these are the shots at the start See one there a little bit to the right. And we look at his dispersion on this. Let's just look at these ones first. So we can see that on average, um, probably carrying it about 230. Let me see if I can see the average here. Yeah, so 232 on average. And we see his attack angle is minus 4.1. So that means he's hitting down on the ball with his driver. And... You see his total distance there on average was 262. Uh, and Trackman calculates total distance uh, based on a summer fairway. So we're really, whenever I'm working with players and they're driving, I'm really only focusing on that carry number, trying to maximise that. Now, if we come back and we just have a quick look at what this looks like from the side. We can see that on... Some of these shots, they're, you look at this top line, they're quite low in flight. You know, if I put the optimizer on, we have a wee look. It shows you that most of his ball flights are a little low at the start. Certainly at the lower end of what his optimum is. So, let's go back now and have a look at how we performed afterwards. So having given him a little bit of instruction on how to change and hit up on the ball, we see his attack angle changes to 0.6 on average up. And look at his carry now, it's up to 256. So we've gained 24 yards of carry, running out the 285. And not a massive change in club speed, one mile an hour uh, faster, which wouldn't explain such an increase. It's all to do with his angle of attack. And if we have a look, let's just see what that looks like with the optimizer then. If we look at some of the shots that he had afterwards, we now see a much better ball flight. So simply by heading up, it's really simple. It was, there was very little other instruction given. By heading up, we can maximize what you do with your driver. And the gains can be huge. So I hope you enjoyed this video and if you want more distance off the tee, you know where to come. Come and see us.